When I talk about systems, I am meaning how can I make the things that I want to do easier to do? And there's so much to unpack there, but just understanding that everything is a system, meaning it has interlocking, interrelated parts, and the output of those parts cannot be predicted from the parts itself. We call this emergent behavior. So what I'm trying to do was essentially anything I'm going from input to output, and there's a big black box in the middle, is how can I make it more likely that I get out at the other end what I want, that that path is the fastest along the way, minimize surprise, minimize defects, minimize delays. So viewing things as a system, it's essentially, hey, I want this. I want to make this type of widget. I want to have this type of behavior. I want to have this type of outcome. And essentially deconstructing that to say, well, how can I make that outcome more likely? Not that I can nail, able to get it down to cause and effect, right? Not to get philosophical, but I don't think true cause and effect actually exists. The universe is just this big black box of emergent behavior. But what we can do is identify conditions that correlate with outcomes that we want, which is essentially saying that, hey, I notice that when I do this thing on the input side, this other thing happens. We can have uh, systems that we have very high confidence in. So an example, hey, when I do a lot of bench press, my chest muscles get stronger. All right, if I, I, I believe that I have this input doing bench press, my chest will get stronger. I don't exactly understand the exact mechanisms of how that happens, but I don't need to. I know if, that if I do this, sooner or later on the other end, I'm gonna get out what I want. And that's really the approach is if we're looking at things systematically, what are the things that I can do so that my inputs will match my desired outputs at the other end?